My name is uh, Dr. James Beck. I'm the Vice President of Scientific Affairs at the Parkinson's Disease uh, Foundation. And today I want to tell you a little bit about a new drug which recently received FDA approval. Uh, the company Impacts is the manufacturer of the drug and they announced that uh, Rotari um, has just been approved by the FDA. Uh, this drug has been a long time coming. Uh, several promising clinical trials have shown it to be very effective for people with Parkinson's disease. But uh, one of the problems the company's had, including manufacturing difficulties, has uh, kept uh, the drug off the market. And I presume those difficulties have been resolved, and now the FDA has approved the drug. Uh, Rotari is an interesting compound. It's a new formulation of something that's been around for quite a long time, carbidopa and levodopa. This was um, developed in the late 60s and early 70s, and our foundation had a role in the um, testing of it in its early clinical trials. Um, nevertheless, uh, something old can be new again, and that's the case with Rotari. So, um, Rotari is, uh, combines an immediate release uh, uh, formulation with an extended release uh, formulation in one capsule. And what that does is ensures that blood levels of carbidopa and levodopa um, are high initially, allows the drug to kick in right away, and then gives a sustained release over a period of time in between dosages. Um, and the advantage for a person with Parkinson's is that for those individuals who ha actually have wearing off of the, of the drug benefit in between dosages, um, this will provide a sustained a level of uh, medicine within their bloodstream and hopefully control some of the um, uh, motor symptoms better than regular uh, carbidopa levodopa alone. So with this new announcement, we still don't know a lot about Rotari. We don't know how much it's going to cost. Um, analysts think it's going to be about the price of uh, Stilevo, around $9 to $12 a day. And we don't know about the dosing of it either. Um, the chair of our medical uh, policy committee, um, Ka Dr. Kathleen Shannon at Rush University, has been wise to point out that it's not going to be a simple one-to-one -one, uh, switch from Cinemet to Rotari. So it's going to require careful adjustment working with your physician. But you can be certain that uh, we'll be on top of the latest development. So frequently check our website, pdf.org. Um, or call our helpline for the latest information, and that number is 1-800-457-6676. And I'll be certain to report back um, anything we learn um, and uh, as we move forward. My name is Dr. James Beck with the Parkinson's Disease Foundation. Thank you for your time.